Hey everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you all the things you can do using the widget tree in Flutter Flow. First of all, let me answer the question, what is the widget tree? In Flutter, everything you see on the screen is built using widgets. Some of these widgets can have one or more children, which means we can build a tree showing how all of the widgets are related. This is the widget tree. In Flutterflow, you can view, build, and change the widget tree in the widget tree panel, which I have shown here. You can tell whether a widget can add a child by seeing whether or not it has this Add Widget button here. You can use this button to add widgets from the widget tree. I'll just add an image to this row right here to show you. When you use this button, it always adds the widget you choose as the last child of the parent. You can tell whether a widget has children by checking for this arrow button here. If it's pointing down, then its children are visible, while if it's pointing right, they're hidden. You can show or hide a widget's children by clicking to select it and clicking again to collapse or expand. Or you can click directly on the arrow button. You can see that the widget my mouse hovers over is highlighted orange and corresponds to the widget surrounded by the orange box in the canvas. If the widget has children, they are highlighted gray. You can click to select a widget, and as you can see, it turns green, and now the green box shows up in the canvas, and you can edit that widget's properties. A selected widget's parent and siblings are highlighted. You can drag a widget to move it into another widget, like this. The orange bar means that the widget will be added as a child. You can see that the image is now a child of this column. You can also change the order of widgets in a parent, and the purple bar shows that the dragged widget will be added as a sibling directly underneath the highlighted widget. So I can move the image to the bottom underneath the text. The bar will change color if you wait for two seconds. So let's say I wanted to make the image a sibling to the column. If a widget has no children, but can accept children, you can wait for the orange bar. So, let me get rid of these. And I can add as a child. And if you need to scroll to get to the widget you want, you can hold your drag widget above or below the widget tree. Like this. You can also drag widgets from the UI builder into the widget tree if you need more control over where you're dropping it. If you want to condense the widget tree, you can press this Collapse All button to hide all leaf widgets, which are widgets that don't have children and don't have siblings that have children. Or you can show all the widgets in the tree by pressing the Expand All button. Lastly, the widget tree shows you which widgets have been configured to have actions, backend queries, animations, conditional visibility, and device responsiveness. So, that's everything you need to know about the widget tree. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and thanks for watching!